Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another challenge video. So today's gonna be a $20 value menu challenge, something I've done in the past. I've done one at McDonald's, I've done one at Taco Bell. Now today's gonna be doing Burger King. So if you guys don't know what this challenge is, Randy Santel, who's another YouTuber, challenges his viewers or other YouTubers to go to a restaurant that he's already gone to, uh, order $20 off the value menu, and if you beat his time, he'll send you a t-shirt and he'll also put you on his wall of fame on the website foodchallenges.com. So I really enjoy this challenge because it allows other people or other YouTubers to kind of collaborate without actually being in person. So with that being said, let's go to Burger King and order the food. Rip, rip, rip it. These are all from the value menu. Uh, can I please have two bacon cheeseburgers, two crispy chicken juniors, two spicy crispy chicken juniors, two cheeseburgers, two double cheeseburgers, two onion rings, two 10 piece chicken nuggets, two cookies. All right, it's 22.38. Damn it, I forgot to ask for no pickles, no mustard, and no mayonnaise. I even wrote it on the paper. Oh, well, it's my fault. I'm gonna have to deal with that. God, I hate pickles though. All right, so both bags are checked. All the items are in the bag, thankfully. Uh, we're on our way home now, ready to start this challenge, so I'll see you guys in my kitchen. All right, guys, so we're back in the kitchen. Food is out, we're ready to eat, and I think the official time to be is 19 minutes and 40 seconds. My goal is to obviously get it under that time, so I'll go ahead and give you a calorie count right now. And without further ado, this is the $20 value menu challenge. You're going down, Randy. So in three, two, one, my timer is started. All right, let's go. Let's get this started. I'm gonna start with the cheeseburgers because I forgot to ask for no pickles and mustard. Oh. There's mustard all on top of that. Oh, but that was my bad. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out the cheeseburgers first since it has pickles and mustard. So those burgers obviously had pickles and mustard in it, but surprisingly, I couldn't taste the mustard at all. I could see it though, which was pretty gross. Pickles, I could taste those. Those weren't very good. So I spoke too soon because on the bacon cheeseburger, there's pickles and there's mustard on it. I can't really taste it because of the bacon though, but still. Thank God there's no pickles or mustard on the chicken sandwiches. We're on to the last one. Let's go ahead and finish this up and start on these side items. So I feel like we get the hard part out of the way, these sandwiches and the burgers. Now we just got the chicken nuggets, onion rings, and the cookies. And this should be easier, I think. Mm -hmm. I take that back on the nuggets, them being easy to eat. Uh, they're very chewy and they're hard, they're stale because I left them out here for about an hour. Oh, okay. Bunny roots. These onion rings aren't too pleasant. They're hard as a rock, and I'm cutting the roof of my mouth. All right, finally, onto the cookies. Oh my God, those onion rings. Those things were rough. Hmm. I think Burger King is slipping. Hmm, these are good. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, we're done. Oh. So challenge completed in 18 minutes and 23 seconds. And really quickly, I checked Randy Santel's time. It was actually 19 minutes and 20 seconds. So we just beat him by one minute. So I think that's the third time I beat him. He owes me three t-shirts. You better not forget to like the video. No, I'm just kidding. If you're watching this, Randy, I don't need three t-shirts. One is fine for me. So thank you to Randy Santel for doing these challenge. I think they're a lot of fun. With that being said, thank you guys for watching my videos. And if you could do me a favor, Stop that like button! Subscribe, comment, share, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Bye. I'm out of here. I feel like a fatty. Oh, what am I doing?